at age eight, I thought that I should commit suicide. Why? Because I didn't have hope. So I tried to give up. At age 10, I tried to drown myself in six inches or 15 centimeters of water in my home. I told my dad I just wanted to relax. But really, I wanted to end my life. I had enough. Dos de mi abio. Okay. Words are powerful. When you hear those words and then your mind starts growing with these lies. Nick, you're not good enough. Nick, just give up. Nick, you're never going to get a job. You won't get married. You can't even hold your wife's hand. What kind of a father are you going to be if you can't even pick up your kids when they're crying? We're all looking for something. We're all looking for hope. That's why we do what we do sometimes. To get into the crowd, I'm going to swear, I'm going to be cool. That's what this world is. I want to look like her. I want to look, if I was taller, shorter, smarter, more popular, whatever you want. It's not enough. I've met so many 50-year-old women and 40-year-old women who still remember what their fathers told them that they wish they never heard. Every single human being has value and my value is not determined on how I look or what job I have or where I'm from, where I was born, how much money, all that stuff is nothing. If my parents never told me that I was beautiful the way that I was, if my parents never told me that I was special and that I was loved, I wouldn't be here today. So wherever I go, I talk about the value of life. I am not a superhero. I go through ups and downs. So do you, but take one day at a time. And if you haven't found that peace of knowing who you are and why you're here and where you're going when you're not here, for me, I want you to know that's how I've overcome 